TMT is steel. What is TMT is steel? Manufacturing process of TMT is steel. Quenching, self tempering, atmospheric cooling. Special properties of TMT is steel. All those will be discussed today. I am Prasad from Structural Guide. You are welcome to the Structural Guide YouTube channel. Please subscribe our YouTube channel. You may get the notification on new videos. What is TMT steel? TMT stands for thermomechanical treated. TMT steel bars are produced to have a higher strength than other types of steel. When characteristic strength of the row steel is 460 newtons per millimeter square, TMT bars increase it to 500 newtons per millimeter square. We can produce characteristic strength of having 550 newtons per millimeter square, 600 newtons per millimeter square, even higher. Outer core is hard and the inner core is softer. It generates high strength and high ductility in the TMC steel. This property is key to generate these properties. Properties such as weldability, elongation, structure has enhanced in the TMP steel. These properties are achieved through the manufacturing process. Manufacturing process of TMT steel. Initially, the billets or steel rod, steel rods are you bought to the manufacturing plant. These rods are heated and you get the required size of the reinforcement bar and the required shapes. After that, you do the quenching and then self-tempering and the atmospheric cooling will be done. Let's see each of these process or let's discuss each of these process in detail. Manufacturing processes of the TNT steel. Under manufacturing process, once you make the rebar, we see how do we gain the strength of the reinforcement bars. Quenching. In this process, the water will be sprayed into the reinforcement bar in a controlled manner. It is specially designed system that allow the water reach to the surface of the steel bar and to make rapid cooling of the outer surface. This process is done to harden the surface and maintain the core soft and heated. Self-tempering. After the quenching process, the bar will be subject to self-tempering. Since the core temperature is high, it will transfer the heat to the surface. This causes the tempering of the hardened outer surface and it forms the tempered Martin type structure. Atmospheric cooling. Then the rebar will be kept on the special band that allow the allow the cool the bar slowly. This makes the core more ductile. Finally, the structure of the steel becomes strong. Outer side, a strong outer layer and ductile core. This is process. We gain these properties. Special properties of TMT bars: high corrosive resistance, high tensile strength, durability, and the almost zero defects in the surface. Weldability, as we discussed, reinforcement can be welded. So weldability is there in the TMC steel, but when you do the welding, you have to be very careful. If unknown person or unskilled person do the welding with higher voltage, the rebar will be heated excessively. If it is ex heated excessively, its properties will be changed. That's because we made the reinforcement do this through this heat treatment process. Therefore, we have to be very careful when you do the welding, the reinforcement, especially those reinforcements are used in the structural elements. Ductility and the bendability also one of the other features of the reinforcement bars. 
high fire resistance high burn ability cost effectiveness of other other important properties of the tmt steel with that we end the today discussion on tmt steel we hope that you gain certain knowledge on manufacturing process strength gain process and use of the tmt bars let's meet again from new video thank you very much for watching our videos